Cam, could you just talk about tonight? And I mean, it just seemed you were on from the get go. Yeah. Uh, first, you know, I want to thank God for you know giving me the uh, the will and uh, you know the confidence and keeping me healthy out there, and and my teammates. You know, they I couldn't do it without them. I couldn't do it one on five. You know, TP got going, RJ got going. Without them getting going, you know, I wouldn't be able to do what I do. You just talk about his. He went went on a run with about nine straight points, about 15 of 19. It just seemed like he was on fire for a while there. I mean, that's Cam Carter. Uh, as we all know, we talked about it in preseason so much, and um, I know a lot of people didn't believe us, but it's on full display right now. And um, like I say all the time, it's no surprise to me. RJ, these two guys to ride have been on a pretty impressive scoring streak early on this season. What what do you like most about what they're doing? Um, mostly what I like about what they're doing is um, they're being real good leaders for us, for as a team, as upperclassmen. Um, they're coming in, showing us in practice what we're supposed to be doing, um, and then also competing. With them, without them helping me out in practice, without them going hard at me, we wouldn't be able to have dubs like this. Tyler, do you feel like this team's getting better with each game? Yeah, absolutely. Um, the best, you know, the best teacher is experience, and um, <clears throat> the more we play each other, the more. Uh, we're going to get a feel for each other. And uh, it's just a matter of time. And we're so far from where we want to be. we got so uh, so long to go. And um, the biggest thing is to just continue to go 1-0 every day. Aside from the three-point shooting tonight, what else do you guys do you think you guys did best? Uh, we stayed together. Um, <clears throat> you know, the last couple games, we, we felt like we wavered a little bit. And uh, I feel like tonight was an all-around effort on, on both sides of the ball. And, uh, you know, give credit to them because they're a very good offensive team. And, you know, we think they'll be a tournament team. And I think, you know, us staying together and uh, staying poised through all their runs and uh, our runs, uh, not getting too high, getting too low, you know, was really a big thing for us tonight. Cam, how would you assess the way you guys defended Zeke Mayo tonight? Uh, you know, he's a great player. But, uh, you know, I, I guess he didn't, you know, he had an off night tonight. But I know, you know, <clears throat> he's going to have a great season. RJ, can you, obviously your scoring was great, but can you, can you take us through the block that you had there? <laughs> uh, yeah, man. Um, you know, my adrenaline was rushing. I felt like I had to go out there, come off the bench, and give energy on both sides of the floor. So uh, whenever we had a loose ball, they threw it to him, and I felt like I had to get back into play. So I had to do what I do. <laughs> but when you saw that first three fall, what, did you kind of feel yourself kind of get into a rhythm a little bit? and? Uh, yeah, for sure. I think um, I think I came in um, with Cam and TP and the scoring, all the scoring that the starters were doing. Uh, I feel like it kind of opened up. It kind of opened up uh, my way of, of getting on the offensive side of the ball. Uh, I feel like they had to close in a lot more because we had guys driving in and getting layups. So with them kicking the ball out to me, I felt like I got comfortable real quick. Tyler, Will, Will had 10 points. Um, it seems like he, he he also is a guy that kind of keeps improving every every game. What would you like best about what he did? Uh, Will's a veteran, and so um, he's gonna have games where he impacts the games in so many ways. Uh, I know you guys look at his ten points, but like I think he had like six or seven deflections in the first seven eight minutes. But though you know those don't get statted. So uh, he's a vet, and uh, we're glad he's on our side. And you know he he impacts the game in so many different ways, and um, you know a lot of things that he does goes unnoticed. Uh, you know, this, I mean, I work hard for this, uh, so I, this me, uh, this is what I'm going to be doing every game, you know, uh, just praying that I stay healthy. Uh, Tyler, uh, you talked about Will, but early on you guys got, I think your first eight points were in the paint. How important was it to get those early paint touches <clears throat> to open everything else up? Yeah, getting to the rim is, is, is vital, especially, um, you know, with us, it opens up players like RJ and Cam to be able to get their shots. And when you got somebody like Cam who can do both, it opens up, you know, shots for me and RJ. So uh, it's always big to open up the game to, you know, enforce your will on people and, um, you know, n to let them know that it's going to be a physical game. And uh, that's the biggest thing is it's setting the tone early, and I feel like we did that. And I think you improved again in the second half. Turnovers were kind of a problem early, but what is that just a matter of – of learning to play with each other still? Yeah, absolutely. Just just getting a great feel for each other. Uh, we're going to continue to learn each other, continue to, to understand the way each other play. And um, I think, like I said, our ceiling is so high. We have so much to grow on. Uh, I think we're only going to get better from here. And 
like I said, I'm I'm just I'm glad to be a part of this program. Cam coming off last year, you know, you did really well and now, you know, Keith and Keontae are gone and coach mentioned that he kind of made a concerted effort to, you know, make you more of a scorer this year. Can you talk about that process and just what that was like during the off season? Uh, it was a lot of hard work, early mornings, you know, late nights, you know, uh, a lot of sacrifice. You know, me and my brother had a talk and, you know, he told me whatever I have to sacrifice, sacrifice. You know, to get you know, be where I'm, to be where I am right now, and you know, I did a lot of that. How good do you feel like this team could be this year? Like TP said, the ceiling is so high for us, man. We we growing every day. We getting better every day. We getting tougher. You know, we showed it out there today. You know, it's a lot of growth still. Of all the shots you made tonight, what was your highlight? What was your favorite shot? Uh, the transition three to RJ, the pass. <laughs> for real though. You got going. <laughs> Just for any of you guys going down to the Bahamas, how excited are you guys? Uh, this is my second time going, so you know I already know what to expect there. So it's gonna be pretty fun, and I'm pretty sure our team gonna enjoy it. And then when it's time to lock in, we gonna lock in. Uh, we I just want to win. At the end of the day, um, not worry about what anybody's expectations is for us, and um, you know, just continue to get better. And at the end of the day, we we know what we're going down there to do. And the and the biggest thing is just to continue to grow on and off the court, and um, you know, go one and zero in everything we can do. Sure. Yeah, I think it's going to be a great bonding experience for our team. Um, get to, you know, still get to bond. Um, I think it'll also we also know that it's going to be a business trip, so it's not we're not going to be lazy and you know just relax on the beach, even though it sounds good. <laughs> but we still going out there to go compete and go win some games. Yes, sir. Uh, this is, you know, this is how it went. Uh, you know. When you know somebody's gone, somebody has has to step up. You know, RJ stepped up. You know, I stepped up. Uh, Will stepped up. You know, everybody pretty much stepped up. And uh, a couple times, you know, when you're playing well, Coach Danny got after you pretty good on the sideline. I saw. Do you like to coach hard like that? Is that kind of what you drive? Uh, yes, sir. Uh, you know, Coach Tang has so yeah, he believes in me so much, and uh, I'm grateful to be playing for him. And yeah. For Tyler and Cam, I've heard that you guys have pushed each other in practice, probably helped each other become a little bit better players. Just wondering if you feel that same way and what kind of impact do you think each of you have, have had on each other's game in the short uh, time you've been teammates? <clears throat> it started out from the summer. Uh, when TP first came here, you know, I had to I had to like put my foot down and kind of just let him know, you know, it's not going to be a cakewalk. You know, it's, it's not going to be easy. And we competed every day, whether it was pickup, practice, shooting. You know, we, we competed in everything that we did, and, you know, it can return our way. <laughs> <clears throat> Just like he said, uh, you know, one of the first people I saw when I first got here walking into the gym was him. And um, I think we both are so competitive people. Um, neither one of us ever said it, but there's, this ain't the first time. It wasn't the first and probably won't be the last time we've, we've went at each other in practice. And uh, I think, you know, us being going at each other so much, it makes it so much easier us uh, on the floor. and. Um, you know, it just it does nothing but make us better. It's been a little minute since, you know, I've had somebody try to check me and then coming from somebody younger than me, uh, I had to really, and, and he can hoop, so it was like I had to really, like, you know, buckle down and, you know, be competitive with him. And I think it brings out the best in both of us and, you know, it's going to end up helping us in March. Tyler, since you're probably being, I guess probably RJ to you, a guy that's experienced being guarded by Cam, what 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 is that like? He's a hound, man. He's a he's annoying, uh, and he's gonna tell you about it. And so uh, that's the, that's the best thing about him, though, is the is the fact that he will let you know, and the fact that he can do it. He can sit there and back it up. And so uh, it's not easy having you know walking out of practice days where he may have kept you from scoring, and uh, you got to wake up and you're so eager to go to practice tomorrow, you can't enjoy the rest of your day. So uh, he's a hound, and you know I I think he showed it tonight. You know it's a big shout out to to Zeke, uh, heck of a player. But uh, you know, that's not new for Cam. That's what he does every day. So Caleb 
Yeah, Y'all haven't yeah, even sure. seen the best of it yet. Man. Y'all have no clue. All. Y'all saw layups. Yeah, y'all yeah. ain't. Y'all don't even. Y'all have yeah. no clue what's coming. <laughs> Thank you guys, appreciate it.